Welcome to my home. As we've all been waiting for, here is the dorm tour. Now, I just got home from out of town, so nothing is like super clean or anything, but this is just the average way it looks. I didn't want to make it all fancy and show you guys what I wish it looked like, being like spotless and hairless and whatnot. So I'm just going to give you guys a tour of my dorm. I do live with my service dog, Koki, and we are in a single with a bathroom and accessible dorm room. Um, but yeah, let's just get into it. So I am down the hall. I'm talking quiet because obviously I have neighbors and everything. But I am down this hall pretty much on the end. Um, and this is my room. Here is Koki and I sign. And then this is what you see from walking in. So when you first walk in, here is my door. That's where I keep my purse. And this is my trash can. And then this is where I've been keeping my shoes. And then here I have a large tapestry. And then here is my like bedside table. This is something I've had for a while now. This is my huge jug of water. And these two are like microwavable plushies. And then this is a sign that my mom got me. And here is just like my medicine and all my like random stuff. In here, there's nothing really. It's just like packing mailers. <laughs> And then in here is a bunch of Koki's random things like her bandanas, potty stuff, grooming stuff, a bunch of random stuff. And then in here is like a bunch of treats and things. And then a jumbled bunch of cords. This is actually like a like a bed desk thing. Um, but that's everything for here. And then you go up to my bed. Here are my pillows and everything. Here is Miss Koki. And then I do have a fan right there, and that's my window. Um, something funny is I have these lights that go around my room, but I stopped putting them up because they kept falling down. So the rest are just right there, and I'm going to have to figure something else out later. But that's for another day, and I figured I'd just film this before I did not have the motivation. So under my bed, there is really nothing under there. Um, just a bunch of Koki's toys. As you guys saw in my move-in video, I did have a white cubicle right there, but having all of this storage that I didn't know was here, I did literally not have anything to put in there. Like, originally I was going to put, like, food and my utensils and my cleaning stuff in there, but then I have that, and that just makes more sense. So I ended up taking that home. And next to where that would have been is Koki's grate. I have the door tied with like a little bit of like i don't even know what that'd be called but she can go in here when literally ever she wants and then next to it i have this which is like a little storage ottoman from target right now it holds all of my sweatshirts but i have to use that to get up to my bed because my bed is like really tall so here's me standing next to my bed it's literally like above my belly button so I have to step on this to then get in bed. <laughs> and it does slip around a little bit, so I've almost fallen a couple times, but it works, so. Oops, you fell. So here's a better overview of everything that I just showed you, and then we'll get on to my desk. So next to my door, I have my calendar, which is like a whiteboard so I can erase it and then do the next month. And then I have some just pictures of family and stuff. And then this is a gift from my boyfriend. And then here is my desk. On here is a printer that my dad got me for graduation, a whiteboard my mom got me, and a bunch of Koki's gear that I need to sell, my mirror, my boyfriend and I's hands. This is like a... Um, a light from Target, but it has a bunch of storage, so I put like all my random items right there. And then next to it, I have an extension cord, power strip, whatever you want to call it, right there to plug in all of these things. And moving down, I have my chair. Again, this is all like supplied. Um, but then on this chair, I have this super cute little like fall dog blanket my mom got me from, I want to say TJ Maxx, but I could be wrong. Okay, so then moving down here, I put my backpack right there, so it's kind of in the way. 
but this is actually just like a movable bedside table that fits perfectly under there. So right here, I will put like my computer when it's not in my backpack. But and then in here, I just have like a bunch of random items. And then this is where I put my electronics. And then move this, and move my backpack. And then in here, I have my makeup and my nail kit. But that is just about everything for my desk area. So then moving on to this area of my room, I have this super nice fluffy rug from Costco that I already had. And then this is where I keep Koki's food. It's just a like rollable storage thing from, I wanna say Amazon. Next to it, I have Koki's um, toy bin, but obviously the toys as you have seen go everywhere, but whatever. <laughs> And then this is the decorations. That will eventually have pictures of my family and friends, but my printer doesn't actually work, so <laughs> we're gonna have to figure that out. And then I got this guy, I wanna say from TJ Maxx again, and it's like a, like a velvet, so it's really soft. So then next to that, I have this poster from a small business here in my college town. And then under that, I have my laundry hamper. I'm doing laundry right now. But these are like little bags and then like mesh bags. Probably do like a cleaning video with me. So I'll show you how I do um, laundry as a college student living in the dorms. If you guys are curious. And next to that I have this bin which just has like a bunch of random stuff for Koki. Then I have this from um, Target which just hangs like her leash and her e-collar and one of the extra bags I have. And this is the wardrobe that they supplied. So in here, so this is what my closet looks like. This is just like all my hanging clothes. It had a mirror on there. Then I keep like my jewelry and like hats and an umbrella and my extra backpacks back there. It's a organized chaos if you want to call it that. And then in the first drawer, I have socks, underwear, and bras and swimsuits. And the funny thing is, is you can't actually open two drawers at the same time, which is very annoying, but it's fine. <laughs> So then in this next drawer, I have my sweats, I have my pants, shorts, workout shorts, pajamas, and leggings. And then in the final guy, I have my shoes and an outdoor blanket and hammock. But that is everything that is in my wardrobe. And moving next to my wardrobe, I have a plant from Target and the sign from, I want to say Hobby Lobby. And then this is Koki's gear wall. So I have like her ears, all of her patch tabs, collars, vests, or sorry, capes, vests, her hybrids, which are right there, her rain jacket, and then her harnesses. And then again, that gear is gear that I am selling. So if you are curious about it or want to check it out, you can just message me on Instagram. Um, but yeah, we have a couple more pieces of gear coming and then I want to do an updated gear tour. So that'll be really fun and hopefully coming soon, but I'm not really sure. Okay, so we just went through Koki's gear wall and then next to here I have my fan because there's no AC in here. And then here is an overview. And then I'll go into depth about what's in everything. Okay, so moving on to my lower cabinet. Um, right here, I just have my printer stuff, so paper and ink, and then in that, I just have all of Koki's, like, food additives, so, like, <laughs> a bunch of chews and toppers and whatever else, and then in that bin, I have all of Koki's lick mat things, so, yeah, I can do an in-depth deal if you guys are curious, but... Then I just have some Ziploc bags and extra toilet paper and um, paper towels. And then above that, I have the microwave that was provided with the room. And then I have my collection of books I have yet to read, my annotating kit. These are my, um, what are they called? Um, like diffuser smells, I don't know. <laughs> and then just a plant from Target and little pumpkins that I have matching with my friend and then this is my diffuser that has to be plugged in right there and then above those is this which I'll show you right now what's in here 
So on the first shelf, I just have a bunch of snacks, guys. I have a really fancy meal plan, which allows me to go and buy a bunch of random stuff at a market, which again, I can show you guys if you are curious, but yep, I have a bunch of snacks. And then up here, I have all of like my utensils and things. So like concealed, or not concealed, uh, sealed containers, an extra cup of my sister's, my utensils, and then my cup, bowls and plates and whatnot. Okay, and then moving horizontally above my refrigerator, I'll show you what's in here. So above my refrigerator is a bunch of cleaning stuff. So like laundry stuff, wipes, extra garbage bags, floor wipe, um, whatever material this is, <laughs> um, like wipes for that. But yeah, so it's just like a bunch of cleaning stuff. But yeah. So then moving down, this is my full refrigerator freezer, like actual like kitchen setup, which is very nice and handy. I have these cute little pens that says who rescued who and Glacier National Park, but now I'll show you what's in here. Really not very much is in here. I have like my condiments and things and then some grapes, energy drinks, water, which I need to fill up and then like a dip, but that's literally everything in here because I'm one person. I can't eat that much, so I don't want things to go to waste and I have a meal plan, so. And then moving down here, this is my freezer section. And right here, oops, and right here I just have like ice cubes. This is like Koki's little drawer. So these are all of her pre-made um, frozen like mats and things. And then that's my ice pack because I have bad joints. <laughs> and then in here I have like <laughs> ice cream and like, um, what are these even called? Uncrustables, some like pizza. <laughs> Um, corn dogs, like a burrito, and then in here I don't think there's anything. So that's everything that is in my freezer. So then next to my refrigerator freezer, I have this little open area which has like cleaning tools, so like my broom and my Swiffer. And that's also where my um, fan is plugged in. So here's the overview of everything we just went over. And then right here I have this sign from TJ Maxx, and this is my university that I got for free, like a little flag thing. And then going in here is my bathroom. And again, this entire room is wheelchair accessible, so it's got like little protectors and super wide doors, as you can see. So that's awesome. Okay, so walking through the door, here is like an overview of this first half. Sorry if I'm going through this really fast. I am doing laundry and I have schoolwork and I have a lot of stuff to get done before school tomorrow. So I'm trying to zip through this. So if anything is unclear or you have questions or want like something specified, an explanation about, you can just like either message me on Instagram or you can comment. I see all you guys' comments. So yeah, um, let's just continue. <laughs> I have stuff to do. But here is like my sink desk area so here i just have cotton rounds this is from tj maxx and so is this with my q-tips and then this is something that i made or i guess painted at like a pottery thing it just has all my chapsticks but then i have like reusable wipes and then my mouse stuff sink hand soap okay so then over here i have like my face scrubber and then this is like my like air scent thing because a person and a very panty dog in this room with like a tiny little window that doesn't really like circulate very well, it gets very humid smelly in here. So we got that to hopefully fix the problem. But then I have this like towel that's again, Halloween dog themed because my life is surrounds my pets. I am a pet person through and through. Yeah, so going over here, this is like my skincare drawer, so all my face stuff. And then in here I have my body stuff and then hair products. And then right here I have my health drawer, so like medicines and pills and cleaning stuff, all that kind of stuff. And then in here is all my hair tools. And then my super cute rug from Target. So next to that, I have this three-tier cart. 
here is where I put all of like my dishes and things. I also have this that my dad just brought to me. It's like a little tool thing. But um, this is where I put all of my dishes to dry after I've washed them. So next down here are feminine products and my um, paper towels and then extra towels and hand towels and all that stuff. So moving on to the most exciting thing is my toilet. <laughs> that was a joke. So I have like um, smelly stuff in case, you know. Um, and then right here I have like a toilet scrubber and then a garbage can. And then this is a squatty potty. Everyone makes fun of me because I have it, but whatever, it's handy. <laughs> but then coming over next to it, I have my scale and my dog's water and food. And then this is where I have my towel and my hair towel. And then next to that is my shower. Okay, so again, this is all wheelchair accessible. So you can just like come on in here. There's no like lip or anything, but this is my shower, lots of handles and things. I got this like clear organizer from Target. This is like my hair stuff and my body stuff, my face stuff and my razor and loofah. And that's my shower head. And then I also have this like mat thing because the guard is really rough. So I have that. And then this is my shower curtain that my sister gave me that I showed you guys in my college dorm hall. Okay, so here's a little overview of my entire bathroom. If you guys are curious, again, this is everything that we've already went through. But yeah, that is my entire dorm room and bathroom and where everything is at right now. I have been in school for two weeks now, or I guess I started classes for a week and then I had like a freshman activities week. But that is everything that is here and how it's set up and everything and the little layout. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you wanna see more from us, follow our Instagram or TikTok. It is at kokidoki underscore working. Again, I went through this really quickly, so if you have questions or concerns or anything, just comment or message me on Instagram. But yeah, I am going to have quite a few more videos coming your guys' way once I get things situated. Things like cleaning my dorm room, or day in my life, going to class, or going to the food zoo, showing you guys how that works. But yes, that is my entire room. Here is Miss Koki, and a little bit more of my room. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day and we love you. Okay, bye guys.